put up my glip glove. <laughs> Don't even have the niggas back, bro. You. Yeah. As you probably already know, YouTube has very strict community guidelines. So if you're not 18, please fuck off of my video. Thank you. Let's have a nice day. What is going on, guys? Stony Rob here, back from another YouTube video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day because mine is going amazing like every other day. And today I'm joined with my homie Chris, who hasn't been in a video for a good minute. You know what I mean? It's, it's been guy. a good while, man. I'm glad to see you again, my broski. I'm glad, glad that you. you're in another video with me today. Yes, it's been sir. a good minute. And I guess you guys know what this means. I am back in the capital city of Canada. I am back in Ottawa. I have left Vancouver. And this is what I'm going to explain here today while we're going to have a nice and normal discussion with no substances at all. We're just going to have a nice and simple PG talk today. So guys, kick back, relax, and find you some some to do, you know, the, the good old thing to get you elevated. You know what I mean? Yo, I'm trying to be PG as frick right now. Oh, I'm trying to be PG as frick right now. You know what I mean? So guys, drop a like, hit that subscribe button, check out my social media links in the description down below and without further ado guys let's get this discussion started all right we are back and we are gonna be having a nice simple discussion you know what i mean so we're not gonna beat around the bush too much and we're gonna start this discussion you know what i mean <laughs> <laughs> nice discussion started bro nah, 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 nah. so yo why do you leave bc why did i leave british columbia yeah it's like a tricky question, you know what I mean? There's a lot of factors as to why I left British Columbia. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of people in the comments section that are going to say, oh, it's too expensive. He left because he went broke or some shit like that. And they might be partially right, you know what I mean? It's expensive as fuck. It's expensive as hell, bro. Like, it's expensive. Like, there's nothing more expensive than British Columbia, man. In my life, I have not seen something in a place that is as expensive as British Columbia. The food was expensive. Rent over there was expensive and if i really wanted to grind and hustle i needed to make like a big salary you know what i mean i need mm -hmm. to make like at least six bands a month you know like oh, a minimum. minimum and and i'd be living in like the smallest freaking apartment the smallest car like i'd live minimalistic over there with 66k you know so it was a tough time but the biggest reason why i left british columbia was because i wanted to protect my energy and if you don't quite understand what i mean by protecting my energy it's because you know as you guys know and as you probably know I went there with a partner you know somebody that I thought had the same vision as me and was aligned spiritually and mentally to achieve basically the same end goal right but once we arrived there there wasn't much of anything right you could compare him to a worm dead ass i ain't trying to disrespect him or nothing i have love for the person and all that and i don't want y'all to hate on him or some shit like that but you know he was literally a worm a not motivated not hustling worm like to the point where if you gotta almost fight a dude each morning when you're like sleeping in the car just so you guys go to the gym right and have that routine that person has a problem you, you know so you're not doing the gym part you're not doing the the study part you're not doing anything you're not trying to find a job you're not trying to find different ways to make money so you're basically carrying amendments exactly i was carrying dead weight the whole time you know jeez yeah, i understand bro it was it was a little whack and he even told me that he didn't like it when i just whip out my camera and decide to make videos you know what i mean so for me it's like your grind bro. it's my grind you know what i mean you're not doing anything and it pisses you off that i'm doing something right oh, it's yeah. like i would have included you in the videos but you don't want to be in the videos i would have done something to make you enjoy the fact that i'm making videos yeah, yeah, but you don't something. want to and when somebody just doesn't want to you can't really force them and you know my grandpa used to tell me this little saying you can bring a thirsty donkey to the river but you can't force them to drink shit you know what i mean yeah I i've never seen donkeys though before but geez. so at that point i was destroying my own like energy yeah, your, your drive for my it. drive to yeah. work by having somebody day in day out constantly next yeah, to me i feel you you know shit but that's important though like i guess it's a good lesson in a way so right now i guess you'll know yeah i'll know next like, time yeah you'll know next time you know but it's not to say i didn't have a good time like yeah. it's tough to look at it at a negative standpoint because there's a lot of good things that come yeah. out of it you For know really what like, i mean facts so just seeing like how 
fucking Canada is so big, bro. Bro, Canada is so big. It was beautiful, man. And, and if you're Canadian, this is a trip you gotta do. Just drive cross country. Yo, it made me want to do that. Watching your videos, I was like, shit, I need to go. And you talking to me? On the phone, the phone yeah. FaceTiming you. Yo, it's, the city is crazy. You know what I mean? Compared to <coughs> Ottawa. Obviously, it's like a big metropolitan city, man. Vancouver is beautiful. It's one of the most beautiful cities I saw, you know? Mm -hmm. in, your life, in your life or like in photos? Canada. But all that to say, you know, like, traveling is really blessed, man. Traveling is a must in life, bro. You know, travel with the right people, you know? Travel, travel on your own. Yeah, travel on your own. <laughs> you like by yourself, honestly. But I don't think I would have done the, <laughs> the cross-country trip alone. You don't mm -hmm. want to do that alone, bro. Yeah, maybe you cop a plane ticket. Like, you know. yeah, or like if if maybe you buy like a certified, you know, Sprinter <laughs> van, like a 2019 model that's not gonna break down on you. I wouldn't even go with that, you know, because you never know. Imagine there's a damn like it happened to us, right? Mm -hmm. I was sleeping in the passenger seat, and out of nowhere, I just find myself in a ditch with dude in <laughs> driving, you know, and we're like, <laughs> what the? F I wake up, I'm like, what the? F I'm in a ditch, and he just tells me there's a de there was a deer on the street, you know. So you, you never know. It. Yeah, you had to swerve it because it's a small. We used we had a Hyundai Accent. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a small car. If a, a freaking <coughs> hundred eighty pound, two hundred pound, even I don't know how how heavy they are, but they're pretty heavy, mm -hmm. in my opinion. Right? We're we're driving at hundred forty kilometers an hour, and we hit that deer, man. Die, bro. We died, bro. That's coming in right into the windshield, yeah. bashing us, bro. And I was asleep, bro. I would have woken up either like in pain with a damn deer <laughs> on me or just dead, bro. I would have woken up in heaven and been like, what the fuck? I would have been so pissed. Yeah, like, I would have been, been at the pearly gates and been like, what the fuck happened? Yo, Where the fuck am I? Just go to the section, bro. Go to section B. <laughs> Why, man? Oh, Why am I here? Yo, man, I would have haunted his ass. I would have haunted his his mama. I would have haunted his daddy. I would have haunted his whole family, bro. <laughs> this nigga turning into the purge. <laughs> I would have haunted everybody he knew for killing my ass that way, bro. Yeah, that was... Ah, oh, shit. I wouldn't have fucked with that, bro. You know, that was an experience by itself. But the whole trip, like, not just Vancouver. That, that's the thing. It's not just Vancouver. I personally, in terms of visuals, in terms of, like, things to see, I found that Alberta was way more beautiful. Like, if you want to be, like, nature, nature, mm. Alberta, man. Okay. Like, really, man, it was beautiful. Like, the mountains, like, you were surrounded by mountains, bro. You wake up in this, like, valley. There's literally mountains everywhere. Big-ass mountains, big trees, lots of water currents, lots of trout. Oh, man, wow. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, we should go to some place in New York, but they got weed legalized there. Yeah. You know? Even LA, but LA is like expensive like and it's far from us. It's bro. far few. It's like three, four days. By car? It's gonna be like seven. Oh like, shit. Realistically, it's gonna be like seven. Cause yo, bro, we're passing through the United States of America. That you don't wanna wanna stop. Yeah. You know, sure. and check some stuff out. You don't want actually just... like even more than seven days. You don't want to do like the whole fucking U.S. in like three days, bro. Four days actually. Five days. Five days. It's seven. Men's. Lost his words. <laughs> I lost my damn words, bro. You know? <sighs> Yo, this discussion is hitting hard, bro. Yeah, we just we just talking. We just talking about it. Mm -hmm. You know, we keeping it low. We're just having a nice discussion, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, this discussion is thumping. You guys know what I mean. You know, it's really thumping. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Nice discussion. But yeah, anyways. So, like, I left because I wanted to protect my energy because of money and I also felt the need to come back and like you know work on myself mm -hmm. and work on this YouTube and work on my other projects you know on the side everything all in all just put in the work you know and get more money I feel like it gave you a broader perspective of life and it made you like go even harder exactly yeah that's what like the benefits of trips do I, I feel like exactly all, all the sorts of trips you know what I mean yeah the ones with the planes, the ones with the cars, the ones that you eat, man. Mm -hmm. All those trips are the <laughs> best, bro. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, y'all, I think that's basically it. Like, that's pretty much all the reasons why 
I basically like didn't stay in Vancouver, you know. Mm-hmm. Pretty much like I think those are good reasons, you know. Those are good reasons. Just sure. protecting my energy, I felt it was a good reason, you know. Yeah. Like, man, like the company you keep is very important, you know. Mm-hmm. Yo, that's a good trip though. Like, yeah, it was. Like, a, I'm taking it positively, yeah, honestly. I'm not taking this negatively. Mm-hmm. I learned something. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool, bro. I learned things. What kind of things? Stuff. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, I'm gonna end the video right here because the video was coming to an end. I was about to do the outro, but for some reason, the GoPro camera glitched out and it only captured the audio and it like freeze the video. As you can see right here, you know, you could see the thing moving. You got the audio, you know, the audio is like getting captured, but the video stuck on this scene. So I tried fixing it. I tried giving y'all the original, but I just want to thank y'all for reaching to the end of the video. I really appreciate it. And I really appreciate the support that you guys have been giving me. We're almost at 3000 subscribers. I'm going to be doing a super amazing 3000 subscribers special. Don't you worry. So keep supporting the videos, keep dropping likes, keep dropping comments, keep checking out my social media media links that are in the description down below i know that was a very subtle plug-in but i think i'm very proud of myself for doing it like that but anyways man thank you very much this is tony rob and i do hope you guys enjoyed the video because you guys know the drill um out